Today, we are going to discuss the basics of Ohm's Law, which is basically the guiding principles of electricity. Ohm's Law is an equation represented by V equals I times R. This allows you to represent whatever is happening in any part of any circuit. And we're going to go over what each of these symbols means and how it's measured. V represents voltage and is measured in volts. Think of it as the pressure in the circuit. I represents the amperage of a circuit, and it's measured in amps. Think of this as the current, or how fast the electrons are flowing in the circuit. R stands for resistance, and it's measured in ohms. It's going to look like a horseshoe, and it basically is a way that we can slow down electrons to a desired level. Now let's go over an example of how this would work in real life. On the left hand side of this picture we have a dam that's holding back lots of water, which is going to represent our voltage. It's holding back pressure, it holds back lots of water. As it goes through the dam, it goes down the river, and how fast that river is flowing, represented by the canoe, is going to be our amperage, or our current. The faster the canoe moves, the bigger the current. And then finally, we can throw rocks into the river, and those rocks are going to slow down the speed of the water, also slowing down the canoe, which is our electrons. So very quickly, we can see that the more resistance, the slower the electrons are going to flow, and then if we remove those rocks, or remove that resistance, the canoe is going to travel faster. And if you were wondering why I for amperage, blame it on the French. <laughs>